Hi, it's Jane with Scraptastic Yarns, and you know my friend and I went to uh, Scraps and Skeins the other day. Told you I really didn't need anything. Um, we were basically dropping off some things that were dropped off to us at the Prayer Shawl Ministry and that we couldn't use, so we were sending them up that way. But you know I got stuff. Yeah, I did. Um, and I have a couple other acquisitions. They had these fuzzy little yarns for 25 cents each. They had a lot of those ribbon yarns for 25 cents each. The fuzzy yarns are great for doing comfort dolls or for using hair with dolls if you want to use that as hair. Um, we're making hand warmers and fidget mitts. Uh, fidget mats as well with the prayer shawl ministry and those are great to add in and then I did find a cotton yarn for a dollar and then I also found this nice little book shawl design by Julie Reed and um, this is part one of basic shawl shapes and I'm looking forward to reading my way through it and of course she has some of her shawl patterns in it as well and then you guys went into the fabric mm. it's a bee themed day is that not adorable and then I got this one And then we have some happy little bees. And these will be made into bags. Maybe. And then there is this one. I thought it was cute with the scissors and knitting needles and, you know, the all kinds of things related. And then there was this one. That was awful cute. And then I got some blenders to go on the inside. Pretty little fabric. And then those little bees there. And then another one that's a little busier with the bees, but those will be some interior fabrics. And then, and then I walked by the petite table. Now, I love petiques. So, um, yeah. So I have some jobs to do. Like I said, this weekend I am cutting out a lot of bags, a lot more of the bowl cozies, and um, I don't know if I'm going to add plate cozies yet or not. I'm trying to decide whether I'm ready to add some plate cozies in. So we'll see about that. Now, let me tell you. I had decided that I was going to make a memory quilt for Thomas. I'm using a lot of his t-shirts, and I still plan on doing that. But he has a couple of dress shirts that I wanted to take and do something different with. Now, some of his other shirts that he's had, you know, button-down shirts, I'm going to use those to turn them into um, adult dignity bibs. But there are a couple of dress ones that I thought that I would keep. And actually, what I'm going to do is... I found this pattern. Thomas loved dragons. Well, we both love dragons. So I'm going to take a couple of his dress shirts and turn those into a couple of dragons um, for some family members. Those kind of things. And one for me. So uh, that was it for my little shopping trip and my acquisitions. I hope you enjoyed seeing that. And I do have... I have gotten in some more fabric for the uh, bowl cozies. Of course, got some more of the yarn fabric in. And then I picked up another couple of different fabrics just because I liked them. Let me get those out. I love the little gummy bears. So I also got it in a lighter color. 
as well as the darker color. And then they had some really cute different had lemons and limes mix. It's supposed to be limes. It's not really limes. It's mostly lemons with the leaves. Because I couldn't find a single lime actually in it. Although it was listed as lemon with limes. And then of course the other lemon fabric. And then I also picked up some polar bears. Those will be made into bags, the polar bears. And then I haven't had a cat fabric in a while. So I picked up some more cat and dogs. And um, I've been looking for some dog fabric and I just haven't seen anything I really like. It seems like everything is either just a certain breed. Um, you know, not kind of a mixed with them. So, you know, we'll see. Like I said, got some more of the orange, more of the lemon fabric. And that is it for the acquisitions. So now I'm going to be busy cutting, cutting, cutting. Um, I am looking at adding possibly some grocery bags in there. Of course, the grocery bags will not be lined the same way that the others are because... Um, that's just going to be a big expense for grocery bags, you know. So, decide not to do that. All right, that's it for today. I will see you again soon. Remember to choose kindness. And as always, make sure you get outside and see the beauty that surrounds you. And know that there is a creator that created all of this beauty for us to enjoy. See you guys soon. Bye.